Hi, this is Maddie here at Sticky, and I'll be guiding you through how to set up a study on mobile devices. Collecting eye tracking data with Sticky is now possible on both Android and iOS devices. And it does not require any additional hardware. This is supported from iOS 14.3 and later and Android 8.1 and later. To create a study on a mobile device, first click on New Experiment. Here you have the freedom to choose between a list of available templates or create a custom experiment. There are a variety of scenarios in which mobile eye tracking can be used. For example, in advertising research, you can test ad impact on awareness, video ads responsiveness, creatives design, and A-B testing, as well as other promo material tests in their natural context. In addition, in packaging research, measuring users' attention to different packaging designs and product details when shopping online can be highly relevant. Next, you will be asked to name your experiment, set an objective and choose recorder type. To create a mobile experiment, choose the recorder type mobile portrait or mobile landscape. When choosing mobile portrait type, participants will be instructed to conduct the experiment with their smartphone in portrait mode. If you choose mobile landscape type, participants will be instructed to conduct the experiment in landscape mode. Click Design to continue. In the experiment design stage, you can build an experiment as you would usually do using the different modules seen here. Most experiments start with providing instructions to the participants. You may choose to fast forward instructions by tapping the screen. Regardless, you will need to choose for how long you would like the instructions to be shown to the participants. Next, you will be asked to insert the media you are interested in testing. It is possible to upload most types of images and video files. You may also enter the URL of the website you would like to test. Sticky will automatically scale the image to fit the participant's screen size, so there are no specific recommendations for image size or resolution. The maximum file size allowed for upload is 500 megabytes. After the media has been uploaded, you'll be asked how you would like it to be presented, whether it should allow scrolling or not, and for how long it should be exposed to the participants. For mobile studies, we recommend keeping the eye tracking part of the experiment under 90 seconds to maximize the usability of sessions being collected. If you're using this media as a filler and don't want eye tracking data collected for it, click the box here to mark it as filler media. If you're testing multiple pieces of media, you'll be given the option to randomize them. You can select how many of the total media you would like to display. Furthermore, Sticky has built-in survey capabilities, allowing you to ask several types of questions in your experiment. After you're done designing your experiment, click Set AOI to continue. Next, you will be taken to the Areas of Interest editor. An area of interest is a section you define in your media that allows you to calculate fixation counts and durations. So how many people noticed it, for how long they viewed it for, and how long it took for them to notice it. You'll receive over 30 different metrics for each area you define. Select the media where you want to add the area of interest and then click and drag until you start seeing a shape appear. If the area of interest is too small, it can impact the validity of your results. When running studies on mobile devices, we recommend defining a minimum AOI size of 1.9 cm in width and height. You will have the possibility to add and edit areas of interest at any point during the experiment design, and even after the experiment fails. Click Audience to continue. You can either field the experiment on your own, providing your own participants, or use our participants. If you select to provide your own participants, you can either send a direct survey link 
to your participants by a social media, email or other means of your choice. You can also integrate a JavaScript snippet into a third-party survey platform to embed the sticky experiment into your online survey. If you wish to integrate the study design in Sticky with another survey tool or panel provider, make sure that all qualification questions are configured to enable for data collection on mobile devices. If you would like to use participants provided by Sticky and use Sticky's advanced audience, click on this option. Under panel size, choose how many participants you would like to take the experiment. A minimum of 100 participants is required per media to guarantee stable results. Under participant settings, you're able to choose the demographics such as age, gender, and many more. Click on contact us for any questions regarding panel. Click on verification to continue to the last steps to launch your experiment. Good luck with creating your mobile experiment.